It's okay. We'll get you out of there. Do not let the thorns touch you. You'll be paralyzed, just like my parents. As if I need to be reminded. Help me pull! I'll loosen the vines! Get that one, Mo. Hold on, it's around her foot! Huh? Stop them! Mo! Freeze! we trade this for Polytheus's crystal, maybe I'll bring back the empty pot. In the meantime, just sit and stew! <laughs> <laughs> Come on, we have to stop them! But we can't leave Buttercup like this. You're right. I'll get the vines off her feet. You're welcome. Come on, Buttercup. We'll take you home. Why not? Did something happen between you and... Oh! The food! Polytheus must have been mad. Did he call you names? Poor thing. Maybe we can still stop Gargona from making the deal. We have to go. Now! Don't go away. I'll have a word with Polytheus. And stay out of that vine. No. Oh, we can't be too late. We can't be. Polytheus? Elves, again. I am not remotely surprised. We had something to make a deal. Ah, oh, but you're too late. That Gargona and her rather dour insect associate have just paid a very handsome price for a lovely crystal. Huh? The deal is done. Delicious. I'll pry that crystal out of their hands if I have to. Come, come, little king. Say what you will about the elves, but you're not thieves. Hmm, ambrosial sweet root. Harvested only by the elves, isn't it? That's right. Where, I asked myself, would an enemy of the elves such as Gargona have gotten it? Certainly not by honest means. As a serious businessman, I simply cannot abide thieves. <gasps> Polytheus, on behalf of the elves, I thank you. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you think I was giving you this? We cooked you the finest morning dew stew in all Centopia. And it was delicious. But did you really think I would give up my most wondrous, precious, expensive item for only a meal? Uh? Um, Polytheus, where's Buttercup? Why? Have you seen her? Is she back, perchance? What if we knew where she was and we could take you to her? What would that be worth to you? Hmm. Buttercup? There you are! Gads Bodkins, don't you think it's time you came home? Huh? Hmm. Still the prima donna. I command you to come back home where you belong. You promised me Buttercup would come home. Now look at her, stubborn beast! She's not the only one. Are you insinuating something? Polytheus, she's not stubborn. She's hurt. So am I. She ate all my food. You called her names. So? Why can't she... Why can't you? Hmm? You mean... Mm-hmm. Really? Buttercup, I... Apologize. Mm. I'm sorry. For all that I've said to you, I'm sorry. Mm. Mm. Now won't you please come home? Mm. Mm. I miss you. Mm. I guess now we know what he really needed. Mm. I never knew a snake and a turtle hugging could make me so happy. See you soon, guys. Bye, Mia. Bye. <laughs>